Hello, it's Salimik. In today's video, we will be testing and reviewing the Forge Dry and Wet Vacuum Cleaner. It can be used for dry, wet, spraying cleaner and vacuum at the same time and it can be used as a blower as well. So is this 4-in-1 vacuum cleaner good as it looks? We will find out very soon. So the cleaner weighs 20.5 pounds, 9.3 kilograms, 1.5 meter hose length and the first thing I saw it has retractable extension core that it drills itself. It has a 4 liter rear tank that can be filled with mixture of water and cleaner and the suction hose will be inserted here. Other brushes and the filters stored inside the vacuum cleaner for saving space. So in the box you will get mesh filter for the wet suction, dry suction filter, two attachment for spraying cleaner and vacuum, brush attachment, floor brush and two extenders. This filter is for dry application and you need to change it to this mesh if you're working with a wet surface but for now I will keep it on the dry filter. It comes with extra o-ring for the hose fitting and the battery for the remote controller. You just need to pop the cover and insert the battery and close it off. The cleaner can be turned on and off changing low and high suction and spraying cleaner just by using the remote controller. The suction looks good but the real challenge will be on a carpet and if you remove the hose and attach it to the back port it can be used as a blower. I took the seats out of this car looks like it's not been cleaned for a long time. We will put Vivor's vacuum cleaner under a test and use all its features. For the rear tank I will mix 1 to 4 ratio of water and carpet cleaner just make sure it's not too thick. Alright let's put the tank back and style with dry vacuum cleaning. Once you turn it on it will run on high suction mode. If you press the power button again, it will run on low suction, but I want to test it on full capacity. The suction looks good, but I was expecting to be more quiet. But if I compare it to my other cleaners, looks to be the same. In this video, we will be using and testing Vivor's vacuum cleaner. And also, I will show you how I would detail interior for any car at home. First, we will start with dry vacuum cleaning and then using wet vacuum cleaning feature. The product link will be in the video description box below plus the discount code. This video is gonna be a bit longer than my usual videos because I wanna show you everything that I did for cleaning this car and using this vacuum cleaner. The brush head will be very useful for any stuck dirt in the corners. So I like to use this brush at the end after cleaning all the loose dirt. Alright next let's change the brush to spray cleaner and wet vacuum for cleaning the carpet. But remember, you have to change the filter to the mesh one first. Press the spraying button on the controller and start cleaning. If your carpet has dirt in it, you will be able to see through the transparent attachment. After I see no stain water comes out from the carpet, I will stop the cleaner and just dry it out. For the seats I will be using the same attachment, it's very easy for controlling but if you have bigger surface you can use the other big brush as well. For the rear seat I use different technique, I use my pressure washer and foam cannon, agitate it with detailing brush and then vacuum it out.
Now I will be using its last feature, which is blowing air. I would say it's okay, because the propeller is designed for creating suction more than pushing high volume air out. After finishing your detailing or cleaning any surface at home, you can remove the top part, drain the water and pressure wash it. It will be ready to use again. In my opinion, it's a good tool to have for cleaning your car or household using. For the size and its capacity for cleaning, I'm really impressed. Product link will be in the video description box below plus the discount code. Hope you guys found the video useful and learned something new. If it was, like and subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.